Okay, hello and welcome back to the stream. I'm Pete, and today we're playing some more Dark Souls 3, I think. That's my final decision. I did have some other options that I was considering, but they're also long games. And I don't want to have multiple long games going on at the same time a whole lot. So... First things first is I'm going to get changed, as fun as this is. What have we got? Four and night's pretty good, right? With... we had the assassin's trousers, I think. We need a hat. We 100% need a hat. Um, hmm. Sure. Slightly different twist. It would be a complete mishmash of cultures. Uh, yeah, screw it. So I'm trying to remember how far we got. We did the deacons, so we've cleared out the cathedral. We could talk to what's his face in the chapel, but I really don't want to bother with that yet. So. guess we go back to the crucifixion woods and on towards Farron. I think that's going to be our bet. We'll see how we go. I'm not a huge fan of the swamp area generally. Um, not an unpopular view of course. But it is what it is. I need to grab my drink before I forget. So, totally just found some donuts that I forgot I bought. Can we? We're all good. Right. Uh, so, there should be Crab Boss over here. Somewhere. That's where we want to go. Uh, no. No. I'm going to assume we managed to kill the crabs before, because I can't be bothered hassling them a whole lot. Oof. Do we? Do we try the parries? I think we try the parries. How are we looking? He's angry. Oh, oh, drained all my stamina, fucked me up. Um, I'm not actually holding shield, thank you very much. Why? Why this? Okay. This is the weirdest bug. Okay. Woo! Let's try reloading the game. And I think I might be pushing it on the uh computer usage still, so I'm going to turn it down a little bit more. Right, restart the game. See how we can do. 
shouldn't be a second. Come on, you can do it. Let's try this again, shall we? I get the feeling we're going to immediately face a ton of aggro off both of them. But maybe not. I'm not entirely sure where we ended up. Okay. This is vital. That explains why I was standing funny. I knew it looked weird, I just didn't twig. Uh, can I draw just you? Don't think so. But maybe. Just maybe. That's better. I should have healed before starting this. I still can. Okay. We got this. Perfect. Perfect! That makes me oh so very, very happy. And we get the Great Club. Shame we're not going strength build this time. Feel like... We get that later on somewhere. Somehow. Yeah. I'm also fairly sure I'm not bothered about getting it. So let's trigger the second guy. Hopefully we can carry on with our luck. I don't think we killed that one. I have a sneaking suspicion. Not the jumping attacks. Yeah. Oh, oh, the up the spins. The spins will be an issue with parrying. Why the kicking? Is he punching me with a cestus? No. No kicks. No kicks. Such weird behaviour. Does he know that I'm trying to parry? Throwing knives? No, the fist. Can't parry a kick. Do that. That'll make him angry. That was just too early. That does surprisingly little damage. Running, jumping, attack, probably can't be parried anyway. Oh, f fuck this guy. And then I bet if I switch to two-handing, he becomes all aggressive, yep. See if we can trick him. Come on. That was just a miss. I'm just gonna... Nope, not like that. You're just missing. Way too early. I'll learn this eventually. Seems like it'll be useful to know. Really? Really? 
Heal. All the bad times here. Let's just... I knew it. He keeps punching me. Cheeky little bastard. I want parry the Cestus? Ah. Oh. It's not going to work. Oh, yes. I knew it. You get carried away with it. I'm on to you now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I see that timing too. We got him. We got him. Really? You know what? We have weapon arts too. Mine's cooler. Excel greatsword. Oh, I need to drop some weapons off. Uh... Hmm. Bloodstained greatsword wielded by one of the watchdogs of Farron, who preside over the slumber of fallen warriors. The blade is a reminder of the exile's past mis misdeeds. Human strength is required to wield it, blah blah, and then it has spinning. The club, from the branch of a giant tree, for breaking shields, or the guards of shields at least. Fairly straightforward. Nothing particularly interesting. I do like this view. That huge outer wall. Um, yeah. The other side of the bridge. Which means the lift goes up the back of... It's got to be that, right? Yeah, it's got to be. Anything? View to an item that we may have potentially missed. That's. I feel like that's behind the Black Knight. Thought I had more drink left over. Mild disappointment sets in. Oh. Summon signs? Maybe. Probably not, but maybe. Can, of course, fairly easily cheese those knights on this, this ladder. Getting them to fall off isn't particularly difficult, if I remember. And they usually die if they fall from the top, or near the top. I think they'd definitely die if they just fall straight in, but that's not completely easy to do. Still with this... Yeah, can we get him on his own? You angry? Gotta be angry now. Yeah. Crit. Hazel. I forgot about you, Hazel. Don't get me now. Really? Oh, shit. Come on, Hazel. She hit me. And it kind of hurt. I'm not going to win that. I lost that. Damn it. Wasn't banking on Hazel. So if I don't Ember, go in, kill the crab, then I can get both. So that kind of works out because Crab Bro ran away anyway. Ran away anyway, yeah. That's what I meant. Just sounds weird. So.
Okay. Something about long elevators in this game. Long elevators? Long ladders. Ugh. Uh seem to be a lot more frequent. Nope. I'll nope the fuck out of that. Crit that. You won't do it again. Nope. Can I trigger bleeding? No. That hurts if I fail. Don't get hit. Don't get hit. Thank you very much. There we go. I knew we'd do it. Great Swamp Ring. Okay, that was worth it. Good to know. That gives us... Or rather, what does it do? Deep Ring. Boost Pyromancies. Rings said to be chiseled from the bone of a flame salamander by blighted pyromancers living in the Great Swamp. It is believed that salamanders are the descendants of demons born of the Chaos Flame. The flame from which pyromancy is also said to have originated. As we found from DS1. Right. Where's, there's our souls. Let's get the items first and then we'll summon Hazel in. Something killed itself? Conjurator gear. Great Swamp Pyromancy Tome. Spells of the Great Swamp are passed down from master to pupil. Without a master, there is no pupil. But without a pupil, there is also no master. So yeah. Clear focus. Before I do this, I think it may behoove me to have one of these donuts I found. And also I just really want to. Keeping it casual on here. It's like, what? 20 past 11. Good time to be eating donuts. Made myself some apple and custard. They are really quite good. Alright. So. In a moment. Hey. Now, I... Really? Kind of pushing your luck there. Saw the flashing icon. I feel like this is far enough. There we go. Where are you? There we go. You're going to have to come closer. Really? Someone else. Fuck's sake.
Which one of them is going to follow me up here? No, I won't have any of the things to make. Enemies hostile. I hear somebody. That's Hazel. Rush, rush down. Oh. Maybe they're being kind and let me kill her first. No, they're going to be dickheads. Come on then. Now what? Now what? There we go. Try that. Try that. How's that feel? Pretty good? Feels pretty good to me. What a dickhead. Would have had a bit of respect if he'd waited for me to at least finish the NPC. Because I'll happily fight then. I don't care. But... I don't know. Guess I'm playing at a prime time. People have always loved being assholes in this area. Let's... Get Hazel, run back to land. There we go. She should pretty much come running straight at us. My suspicions are correct. Probably from that way. Pillage? Oh. Didn't know they had moss. Yep. Is that spook? Come on, Hazel. Woo, really? That shit doesn't hurt as much as I expected. Really? Ah, what a pain in the ass character. I should have realised. That does so much damage. Wasn't paying attention. And then of course if I move away. I'm going to get caught by all this bullshit. Okay. There we go. Far too obvious. Far too obvious. Every NPC has so many heals in this game. Yeah. Now you're out. Now you're out. Now you're out. Fuck off, you little shitty crab. Whoa. Whoa. Pew, pew. He's doing it all, boys. There we go. There we go. Missed the first one, got the third. Got kind of a bit wrecked by the second. Sure. 
now to get super invaded by everybody else as we go beyond here. <sighs> sure, we'll be fine. Hold the tears in. Hold back the tears. Oh, frame rate. Frame rate. Eating it as we load the uh, swamp. Load it in. Do I even give a fuck about poison, left or right? I feel like I usually go left, so I'm going to go right and thus get lost. It's a good plan, right? It's a good plan. Only good things can come of this decision. Let's get all the obvious shit we see. Do we still? We do. We can zoom. Don't want to overdo it. Need to be wary of the basilisk, bros. This is why I didn't really... Yeah. Usually go right, I guess. Good evening, Kasha. How are you today? Hope you are well. Oh no, oh no, oh no you don't. Like that. Oh no, getting mobbed. Just die, get out the way, get out the way in any direction. Don't instantly die. Ooh. Ooh. Tense, tense. I'm good, thank you. Yeah. Shitty little creature. There you go. Basilisk bros are back from Dark Souls 1. They're still a pain in the ass. Shit. Should probably take at least the firebombs off. No. Probably fine. I think we're going to get invaded again as soon as we get round this corner. Can we move? Pretty please. Soul. Great. Amazing. Just what I always wanted. I feel like she's usually right around here. There we go. Oh god. No. No, 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 no. This is not how this was meant to go. You know this. You don't care, but you do know this. I care. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Annoying little wizardy shit. Way too early. No, 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 no. Should be dead. Should really be dead. There we go. Calm down. Whew. That's fine. I can deal with that. And once more. There we go. Not perfect, but it'll do. We survived to fight another day. So today, Kasha, we've gone into the swamp. Only slightly further from where we left off last time. Uh, basically, we're trying to find these flames and put them out. Fortunately, we're already out. Oh. Not entirely sure what those sacks are. I think they're meant to be hanging from the tree. No. That move sucks. More super agile, super aggressive humanoid creatures. This game's full of them. Red Guy is an invader, but it's an NPC. It's a computer invader. 
Homeward bones. They sure want us to leave this area. Hmm. So we reach the first flame. Which seems to represent the royal family in a way. I've had Orlando anyway. Suppose you'd have Gwyn and Guinevere. Gwendolyn? I don't know. Anyway, we put the fire out. We put the fire out. I have sweets. Let's be grown ups with fruit pastels. On. And if we light or extinguish all three flames to light those three flames, the door will open. Oh no. Friday afternoon, I guess people are finishing work and going home for the weekend now. It's probably going to cause extra stress on the um, local internet. That's fine. If you can't, don't worry about it, Kasia. Day, night, it's all the same. I think this is the other side. Oh, yeah. People, time for people to settle in for the evening with them. Oh, shit. Film and stuff like that. Mm. Poison swamps, everyone's favourite. These guys suck. Ah, oh, giant explosions, yay. Literally hitting me with a tree. Have you heard of overkill? Jesus fucking Christ. Out of Estus. Apologies for the language, but this guy is ridiculous. Whoa, whoa, wee, wow, wow. Wee, wow, oh, wow, 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 wow. Sure. Yeah. I'm going to die just from the poison. At this point, I may as well save the bother of coming and collecting my souls and just go back. And start again. And possibly just go the other way. Oh. Well, yeah, because there'll, there'll be fewer people on trying to use the internet, I'd imagine, at those times. I died. It's fine. Oh. Well. More leeches. They sure love their swamps and leeches. We have a mask. Not much use to us. Item. Must be a trap. Probably not worth it. Okay. Esther Shard, probably the single most important item we could have found in this area. At least we've got that out of the way. And up here should presumably be another fire to put out. I'm in a good mood. I've got the weekend off. I'm, I'm done. And played some cards earlier. Got some sugar. Add some pizza. Stone Palmer, that's a shield. Hooray for a shield. 
Let's get... No, nothing over here. Sure. I really can't be bothered fighting you guys. I want to go over there, though. I definitely want to go over there. Who remembers Dark Wraiths in Dark Souls 1? Damn it. Kicking my ass. Whew. There we go. That's how you deal with Dark Wraiths. Ideally, anyway. Come on. Come on, you big angry mother. Oh. So fast. There we go. Perfect. Perfect. And stabby stabby. Drops us some gauntlets. I feel like there's something else fairly important in here. So let's... Go into what clearly isn't... Oh. Sage's coal? Felt sure this would be a trap. Sage's coal. Crystal blessed and deep. The white magic flame produced by this coal was given to the undead legion long ago by one of the crystal sage twins. So. We can expect another matching the boss we fought somewhere. Uh, see, I just brought pizza from Domino's. <laughs> I still have a little bit left. I'm looking forward to heating that up. Um, let's go back a bit and go up here to the fire. My way's easier. Buying pizza. Well, I suppose you're buying it either way, but... You know what I mean. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Heal. Back down. Cowed out. Nope. Nope. I say. Nope. Not for you today. Woo! He's like, I'm going to kill you. I don't care what you say. Overly aggressive little turd. I'm going to hit you with my stabby stabby stick. That's my grown up web swords. Plenty of time to play with pizza dough. Yeah. I get my share of playing with dough. I feel no great urge to do it at home most of the time. This, if I had to guess, this stone tablet would be the bed of chaos. Got the mother of pyromancy there, looks like she's in a hood holding the flame. And then the tree kind of appendages that were coming out of the bed of chaos above her. If I had to guess. I love fruit pastels. Dough's overrated. Who needs bread anyway? world without sandwiches would not be worth living in. Oh god. Item first. Nope. Nope. I say. I say, I say, I say. Uh, let's backtrack a teeny bit. Just to double check I haven't missed anything. Nope. That's the tower. There's this angry fella here. Cinnamon rolls. I had one of those today. A cinnamon roll for the first time in ages. It was tasty. Not gonna lie. There we go. What have we got? Tie tonight. Sure. Sure, sure. We do have another weapon to upgrade if I remember correctly. 
Twin blades. Can't be bothered hugely in fighting unnecessary battles at this moment. Oh, that item, whatever. I am going to look for a ladder at some point, though. Yeah, cinnamon rolls are good. I like the um, little ones that you can get in a can. You open the can. What? Are you throwing shit at me? I think he's actually throwing shit at me. Yeah, you open up the can and then you kind of roll them up and put them on a bacon tray and just throw them in the oven. That's so simple. Nice, warm, fresh cinnamon rolls. Usually come with a bit of icing too. I may get some tomorrow. Breakfast. And thus, the gate is open. Hmm. Ah, yes. So we have the bonfire here at least, which gives us a better point of reference. Let's run in. Can we do it? Can we do it? We did it. We did it. We did it. We made the bonfire. Because uh, I keep forgetting to do this and it's causing me actual grief at this point. Dagger, bandit knife, barbed, bat, lumbersh, bat. Okay, and that, and that, and that, and that, and that, and that, and that. And that. That's better. We are going through those doors we just opened. Well, actually, no. That's a lie. First of all, we're going somewhere else. But we, we shall be going that way. Eventually. It almost certainly wasn't worth fighting these guys. Did he heal? Did I hear this one out here healing? I think I did. Oh no, he may poison me in this poison swamp. He did heal. Cheeky little turd. Just hit him. There we go. Crying out loud. So. Hom. Oh god, those three are a thing too. Uh, I wonder. I wonder if I can be cheesy. Oh god, there's other enemies down here. Oh, I'm gonna get wrecked. Oh no, oh no, this is not how I thought this was going to go. But then, should be fairly apparent at this point, the lack of thought is the main falling, failing. Falling, no, I'm a fool.
forgot about the explosion. Hey King. <laughs> Just in time. I was about to try and blame you for that death, but no, that was all on me. How's it going? Um, I'm not entirely convinced I care enough about the bow to fight those guys. Oh, we're going the wrong way. Are we? Yeah. Um, dudes, dudes. I'm getting too, too loose. Too loose. I don't care enough. We're going to fall off. Souls. Somewhere down here, surely. It's one of you. You weren't meant to follow. Rude. Rude. Very rude. Okay. I'm not important enough. Mm, that way. No. No, those three can stay there. I haven't got that yet, though. Yeah, I'm pretty good, thanks. Looking forward to the weekend. Very, very much looking forward to finally having a day without a morning alarm. As an added bonus, I seem to have the place to myself this weekend, too. It's my housemate's away. Yeah. Sit behind your little shield. Um, another crab. Hooray for another crab. Although, if I remember... We keep him around here. Ow. There we go. Oh, I'm going to die if I try and find where he's shooting from. That is a bad idea. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Mainly, to be honest, it's going to be a case of, oh, I can clean and without anyone getting under my feet. But that's good in its own way. God, I sound so old. Finish him. I can't be bothered risking myself. There we go. These will be young white birches. We got the lingering dragon crest ring from the crab. Crown of dusk. And the young white branch. Just keep going. Ember. Useful. Anyone got any interesting weekend plans? What? There's another. They're fine. I thought I heard more basilisks. I wonder how well... Oh, that works for getting across the swamp. Not amazing. Kind of just mashing my face against this game at the moment. There's the door. That's fine. Still not found. Oh, there's another thing. We still have more to explore. Let's make this simpler. Uh, yeah, I'm going to do a few odd things. Going to do some sketching. Going to work on a couple of little side projects. No, no you don't. Catch up on Bojack Horseman. I'm going to do that too. I keep forgetting that that's out. Uh, that wall? 
wall, I think. Ah, no there. Found it. Totally knew where I was going. Totally knew. some point, probably tomorrow morning, I'll have to send some messages out, see if anyone's around and wants to do something. On one of my rare weekends off. I'll probably do another stream tomorrow night too. I Get out of there. Get out of there. I also may go visit family. On the Sunday. See how that goes, see how I feel, see what the plan is as well. Don't know. Wolf's blood sword grass. I have completely disorientated myself. Disorientated? Disoriented? Anyway. I found it again, we're fine. Get out of it. Anything? Up we go! Oh. I remember. I remember this way. So yeah, I think, yeah, knew it, somewhere hidden around here. Twinkles, message in case we couldn't find this ourselves. Dream chasers ashes, ashes, there. Burp, burp. Umbral ash of one who dreamt of joining the undead legion. With this, prepare new items, blah blah blah. In the end, the dream chasers who wandered aimlessly in the rotted forest found a sense of fulfillment. Sure. Okay. Yeah. Such a weird, but really cool statue. Because I don't think it's just the wolf model for the enemies. Um, we have the gesture. For what it's worth. Mark. Let's go up. Oh, let's sit first, actually. Do things in order. I may have to do something about this face soon. I can't remember when we get the ability to fix that. Properly anyway. I'm not going to focus a whole lot on this playthrough, I think, on random NPC side quests and the like. Mainly because some of them I don't have the stats for, and some of them, uh, they're just a total pain to get. No, the wolf, wolf isn't dead. It's a statue. It just looks very realistic. Uh, yeah, let's do this way first. Screw it. I wonder if this can bleed. Oh look, another one of these, for the millionth time. Getting their value out of whoever designed it. Oh, really? Think I can survive? Or am I dead? I'm just dead. Or so I thought. Double sip. Oh yeah, gotta make sure to show that off. I breathe rocks. How's that work? You tell me. He is slightly faster though than all the other demons we've 
ever ever fought of this variety anyway. The asylum demons. I miss the tiny little baby wings. They look really weird in this texture. I'm not convinced I'm making him bleed either. Just let me kill him for the love of God. Just swing the sword. There we go. Soul of a stray demon. Yep, 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 yep. I was hoping I'd be able to show off the thing where you can chop his legs off and he crawls around. But I'm not that disappointed because it also makes him actually quite a lot harder to fight. Yeah, great axe. Uh, soul of a stray demon. The stray demon, now lacking even a trace of flame, was once the gatekeeper of Lothric. So I guess this was just his spot. Also, who knows where this bridge ever actually led. But yeah. Uh, onwards. He does look like he was made from rock. And added to that, he breathes the rock, so... I wonder what genre of music he likes. Let's not kill myself unnecessarily. Unnecessary. Ooh. Screw it. This is going to get us so much trouble. Uh, let's run you that way. Nah, there we go. Saved it. Another shiny shiny. He's not seen us. Large shards, really. See this dead old dragon here. Now you remember, not that long ago, there's the other broken side of the bridge with all the pilgrims on. So we came from over there, and we went down and around, and we've come back up. Quite a little tall. I see another sparkly sparkle crystal lizard. Wonder if he's going to try and lead us into a trap. Maybe he will. Who knows? I know, and he will. Just like that. Heavy gem. Not even worth it. Not even worth it. Damn it. Let's get out of the way before we die to a chump. I can heal, you can't. Whoop. Nearly rolled off the ledge. We good. We good. I'm glad you remember. Does kind of, um... Yeah, because if I get a view from up here... Okay. He doesn't want me doing that, apparently. Can't argue with him. Can we? Can we see up to the other gate? No, for some reason there's a wall there. There should be a gate. Hey, don't worry, you'll get yours too. Oh uh, no. Oh no. What a shit. Calm down. Every enemy in this game pretty much just needs to calm down. At least for a little bit. This pilgrim made it across. Somehow. Still got stuck at this gate. And died. That's a shame. We'll we'll find out a bit more history about them later. Boom. Um. 
Okay. Anything even up here? No, nope, that was all pointless. Oh, I fell down. Oh, I fell down some more. Uh, walking is hard. Killing enemies is the easy bit. The walking, that's where you really get stuck. So. In fact, I think we want to go back here anyway. Quickly, to do a couple of errands. If we can hand in the Esther shard, possibly plural shards, before I forget as well. Burn the bone shard. Shards everywhere. Okay, we're out then. We can level. Welcome home, master. Before we go in towards the boss. Very well. then take nut, take nut, 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 but. Uh. I don't want more stamina. Let's go to 20 for now. Farewell, Ashen One. Ma oh. We have ashes. Ashen One, what woeful umbral ash is this? Woeful. This barren dust stuff of a fool won't yield. Oh. oh. Excuse me. <sighs> Tell me for the sport. Uh, I'll tell you, it was in the swamp, but... Oh, yes, I see. Clinging to lofty dreams in this dying world. Uh-huh. Pity. It must come from one most foolish indeed. Wouldst thou not agree? <sighs> Honestly, I think she knows way more about this than I do. Thank you, Kasia. See what else she has to sell now. She finally has Titanite Shards for sale. Now that we have enough anyway. Meh. Such is life. Anything interesting? Not really. Exile gear. Ashen one. Oh. <laughs> uh. Wonder if we can send him anywhere. Let's do this first. That is good, wasn't he? Ooh. 100% want to try these. Oh, we have enough large shards. Let's do this first, since it's our primary weapon. That gives us them up to a plus three. Shit, accidentally went too far. Mm, I wanted to save them, never mind. So 148 plus 35 is 183. The katana is just way higher, but this probably attacks faster. But that is bleed. Mm, I don't know what sword I want to use. Hard decisions. Hard decisions. Heavy. If I had another sharp. Okay. Oh, give coal. Well, well. What's the undead legion doing with a coal such as this? I'd heard one of the crystal sages had sided with Farron's abyss watchers. I suppose it must be true. I don't know about must. You should but... know. This coal is imbued with magic. First one I've ever seen. Hardly a surprise, is it? I've never been one for books or wise men. <laughs> I think at least with two equal powered swords I can just swap around a bit. Can we infuse anything else? Crystal blessed. I think we might do the classic thing here. Never know when it's useful. Pretty be I go. <laughs> I know it's a cliche, but there we go. Uh, let's try these now. So much less damage. I don't want to do it right now. Not until I can infuse it. Let's keep with the samurai sword. It's worked well so far. Uh, let's see if we can send Grey Worm anywhere. 
he likes to go explore. Maybe he can do it again now. Oh, and in one piece. You can keep them as. Nope, he's all right. While we're here. Goodbye, Marty. <laughs> uh, well, there's this sword. The katana. Shouldn't do that, really. Or uh, this sword, which is a curved sword, but also is two swords. Ah, screw it. I'll go this for a bit. So, our efforts have paid off. And Yol is just kind of dead. Or at least he's sure as hell ain't moving. Oh, prithee. Art thou good Yol's master? I am Yoria of Londor, a close friend of his. Thanks to thee, your soul is redeemed. Allow me to express my gratitude in his stead. Another matter. That a lord, art thou not? Bearer of the dark sigil. And our lord of hollows. For the time thou remainst our lord. We of Londor shall serve thee. And I, of course, am also thine. So, yeah. She thinks we're her lord. Oh, good hollow. I'm afraid I must say. Orbeka Vinheim is a cause of much consternation. Oh? He proclaimeth himself lord of hollows. If left alone, he may one day imperil thy rule. Fall to this matter yearly, else we are unraveled. Decisiveness is the mark of a true monarch. Oh! My wits. Shit. Uh, bad times. Knocking things. Speak thy desire. She's not angry. Honorable Lord of Horrors. She did pull her weapon. But I think we're okay. Whoopsie doozy. Get that. Braille Tome of Londor, first spoken by Lillian of the Sable Church. I didn't mean to cash it. I was messing around with settings and I may have clicked something. This is a forbidden tome as it offers salvation to all hollows and conversely curses all things living. This is what we want, but it's 5,000. Gonna do it. Till we meet again. May the While guessing time. We need 5k. This gives us three. Way over what we needed. Honorable. That's fine. We'll probably still spend it. Did I? I didn't buy that. Till we meet again, may the uh... um... screw it. Yeah, worth it. Still think we need a hood. This is the really important stuff. That's dumb. A lot of these hats look straight up awful. And that just looks... Maybe. We'll do that. For now. Uh, right. Orbex fine. She's fine. Weapons. 
we can get another ring before I forget. That is important. Mm, using the soul of the demon we got. Don't worry, we'll be back into the fighting soon. Aha, that is quite possibly my favourite boss in this game coming up next. Sure. That also costs 5k. That is fine. I will happily spend that. Perfect. Perfect. This ring increasing our equip load. I don't think we need it right now. It doesn't benefit us. Not really. Yeah, screw it. It's fine. <gasps> Esther Shard. Nearly forgot. Nearly forgot. I get so lost in this place. Almost every single time I come back and try and do anything, I end up doing multiple uh, full rotations good of the place trying to work out which way is the way. is to Andre. It's kind of doesn't feel like the greatest design. There we go. I have an extra drink. This may be everything. We have nine now. You can get off quite a few attacks with it. So up to 10 drinks total. Keep ruins. There are a lot of bonfires in this area very close together. It's a little bit weird. Especially considering how many places... I don't know, like most of the swamp, no bonfire. Actually, even then, I don't know. They just seem very close together in general in this game. Let's try our new swords. Well, they certainly help to be aggressive. Oh god, oh god, oh god. <laughs> uh, yeah. So don't do that. The thing with these guys, even if you're trying to be careful, they have a tendency to aggro altogether. We don't even want to go that way. We don't even want to go that way. We want to go this way. Right? Right. Let's ignore them. Getting mixed up. Flipped upside down. We're all good now. Don't get poisoned, pretty please. Really, please. Hmm. Shriving stone. I'm not going to risk these guys attacking me once I get past. There we go. Someone's waking them up. There goes the poison cloud. Helps if you actually hit them. There's some pro strats. Hit the enemy, kill them, deal damage. Vital success. Vital force success, even. There we go. That looked goofy, but it worked. This way. Uh, yeah. We missed the start of this fight, of course. But up ahead we have some Dark Rays, and um, those other creatures are called Gru, if I remember. And one of the few occasions of enemies fighting each other. Albeit in a very set-piece way, in this instance anyway. I think we let most of them kill each other this time. And go around the back. 
as much as we can and collect some items. And hopefully... Well, I mean, if we're going to pray for anything, we pray that the Dark Wraiths lose. But there's not a great chance of that. So... We'll almost certainly have to take them on. Ember. Great. Have 19. Huh? Oh, one of them died. Really? One of them actually died. Wow. Kind of shocked these guys have it in them. I forgot I wasn't dual wielding. Uh, well, that's Groot in Guardians of the Galaxy, isn't it? I think they're like G-I-U-H. I might have one of their weapons. Or, much more likely, I've got to put it away. Uh... Yeah, I'm fairly sure if I had anything of theirs, I would have put it away already. There we go. There we go. When I wasn't ready for him. I parried way too soon. Cool hand shields though. Oh. We just both miss all over the place. Is that how this is going to work? It attacks so freaking fast. And then slow. Sounds similar. I'll give you that. Maybe I'm drawing. Jesus Christ. I should just kill him. Let's stop messing around. Anyway. Cracked red eye orb. I think that's all the items. Don't see anything else sparkly. Oh, betcha up there. Betcha. It's got to be right. No? No. Hmm. Well, never mind then. Let's go open up another shortcut. So we can avoid a few extra enemies. I think it might actually be a longer journey. I can't remember. But it certainly feels longer if it isn't. Um. Trying to remember what's down past it as well. There's only one way to know. Only one way. Let's go have a look. Hi, friendo. Noise. Noise. It's less the butt that time, more like the upper thigh. Very close to the butt stabs. Just staying clear. Okay, yeah, I know where this comes out. Now I remember... Watch this thing wreck us. There we go. Nope, just mash. Mash a bit harder. Great magic weapon. Not worth it. And over there's the Black Knight. Who I'm not going to try and face again right now. Because he's just a pain in the ass. We'll have a look eventually. Do want some of his gear. Although the sword won't work on this build. Alright, let's have a sit. 
And then let's have an ember. Let's clear out this place one more time. Have a look for anybody around summon that might make it interesting. I think there's at least one or two NPCs. Can't think who. Um, oh, the the crestfallen warrior is going to be one of them, isn't he? Whatever his name is. Hangs around Firelink. Used to be a member of the Watchers. If I remember. Or at least a follower. I don't remember the specifics. No? I'm going to hold back a second. Just because it makes it a little bit easier. If I let them get on with it on their own. In fact let's go around the side. Give us something to do while they kill off each other. Let's not be totally lazy. Three hits. Three swings rather needed. Look at them. Edgelords. Cool design. Never liked wearing the armor, but I like facing them. Don't want to draw their aggro against me, because in the worst case scenario I get everyone attacking me at once. That's no good. That's a no good. Do I even bother messing around with the shield? Blackhand Gotthard. Gothard. However you want to pronounce it, I guess. You can come in. You can have a battle. Oh, oh, did you kill them both? Congrats. I missed your remote, man. I missed your remote. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, what are we doing? By my sword, wasn't it? Yeah. Not a bad emote. Not a bad emote. I felt like someone else should be here. I don't know. He's enough anyway. Multiple masks. Fantastic. Some fun times going on in there. I can hear it. Let's have a look. Let's poke our heads in. Looks rather empty, right? Never mind. Let's have a cutscene. That's a big sword. I approve. I do love using this weapon of theirs. It does all the super cool but relatively useless flips and stuff. Which is a strong selling point for me. Is it useless? Yes. Does it look cool though? Yes. Well then I'll have it. So, very easy to stagger. Can backstab. Extra added bonus. Let's, um... Oh. I sure will, Kasia. Uh, I'll fight with him. Gotthard will fight with him. They'll fight each other. I should probably stop messing around waiting for the other one. I think I've locked onto the real one. There we go, there's number three. 
Doesn't want to close in. Kind of odd. Oof. Trap him in between. Oh, okay. I possibly don't want to get involved in that. How's Gotthard doing? Gotthard's doing fine. Stab. Cheap, but you do what you got to do. There we go. First form down. Bonus cutscene. I mean, boss dead. Boss dead is what I meant. Absorbing the power from his fallen comrades. Do kind of wonder why this one in particular. Is it just it ha doesn't really matter which one it is. They can all become the most powerful or... I mean, not, not they can all become the Lord. Because they can't all physically be the Lord of Cinder. If there's an army of them, right? Right? Not entirely sure. But yeah. Now he's on fire. So be afraid. Just realised we're both twin sword bros. This may be a bit unfair. I may regret this. It's a, I don't know. It's kind of a fun fight on your own, but it can also be a huge pain very easily. Just thinking aloud out as, bleh, as much as anything, Kasha. With most things in these games, there is no definitive answer. That's half the fun of it. Can't see. Too much smoke. Gotthard's doing it. He's not doing much damage, but... We can spin. We can spin. How is it? I can't remember how to keep spinning. Is it because I'm out of stamina? Anyway, we have the cinders. We have the soul of the blood of a wolf. Which is quite a mouthful. So... That's it. Cinders of a Lord left by the Abyss Watchers. We ain't Tesco's. Cash every little helps. If the Lords will not return to their thrones themselves, let them return as Cinders. The Watchers of the Abyss swore upon their shared wolf's blood, which also served as their mandate as Lords. Their mandate. Hmm. A contract of a sort? A contract to the people? A contract to the fire? Let's check the soul. Soul of the blood of the wolf. The blood was spread amongst the abyss watchers, and their souls are one with the soul of the wolf blood master, who quite simply may or may not be Artorius. He totally probably is. But he, he might be Artorius. From Dark Souls 1 in the DLC. Here's another cool fight. Uh, so. Yeah, Abyss Watch is down. There's a couple of fights I'm 100% going to do on my own in this game, including uh, the Pontiff. But I think where we've got NPCs, or even potentially human allies, we can have some fun with it. I don't want to use random people, but if there's anyone that pops in the stream or is in the stream that wants to do some co-op, totally up for that. Just have some fun with it. Although, 
see, he's got the Artorius Greatsword. The Wolfblood Greatsword, don't they call it in this, I think? Beto. Beto. Cool. Not a huge fan of this area. Kind of tempting to just skip large sections by jumping off, but... Let's try and resist the urge for now. No promises. White eyes. And now we get souls and he's dead. Right, so before I go any further, I'm going to pop back very briefly and we're going to go spend these souls. Because once I lose them, they're gone. And I'd rather get a couple of levels out of it. Hopefully a couple of levels. This will be a quick journey. Literally just spending souls. Oh. Oh. That being said. Hello again. I have since heard a great deal about you. For one, that you are most gentle of heart. Ah, oh, true, we are. I too am bound by duty, but can offer you my sign. I hear that cordial intrusion lays the path to embers. If I can be of help, by all means, do call upon me. Blessing of the moon upon your journey. More emotes. Dark Moon Loyalty. Let's have a quick look. We will be wanting that at some point. For raisins. If you should require assistance, use my sign. Blessing of the Moon upon your journey. Okay. And purely because I know. I'm sorry, I forgot about these dialogues. But I know he has something to say. The firekeeper must be twitching with delight. But what do you really know about these lords of Cinder? These supposed legends? Sweeties. Let's take I know I have sweeties. A right and proper cleric. Only he developed a habit of devouring men. Oh, I. He ate so many that he bloated like a drowned pig. Then softened into sludge. So they stuck him in the cathedral of the deep. And they made him a lord of cinder, not for virtue, but for might. Such as a lord, I suppose. But here I ask, do we have a sodding chance? I do love that British localization. <laughs> do we have a sodding chance? Sorry, chance. Queen's English. Lothric, it was if. <laughs> anyway, I thought he had something about. Haven't give you can make better use of this. Oh, we've missed a lot I of stuff. Need it. Not now I've flown the coop. Hmm. <laughs> the undead legion. Ah, there we go. There's a caravan of undead, sworn by wolf's blood to contain the abyss. The legion will bury a kingdom. At the first sign of exposure. Joyous bunch, really. Gaining admission to the Legion is a matter of some ceremony. Inside their keep, snuffing out the flames. We've already done this, of course. Of Probably should have got this dialogue earlier. Blood. Probably. Even a cursed undead want to believe they're special, it seems. I pity the sorry souls. <laughs> Gaining admission. Either. Anyway. So a caravan of oh everyone's appearing when we're trying to be quick. Yeah. Uh, I know you. Been some time since we met in person. I just dropped in to see how she's getting on. Now, what are you playing at with this circus? 
This cesspool of doddering old folk and Circus really does describe this bunch of people, doesn't it? Be None of them could here. possibly be considered functional. <laughs> This place is a good note. Cesspool of odd folk and degenerates. Anyway. Spendy spend souls. Very well. Then touch the duck. Take no. Figure to 20, I think, as well. And then we can just start pumping decks. And possibly even luck. Fact. I think Vigor first. Have some more health. That'll make me happier. Farewell, Ashen One. May the blade. Cool. Uh, oh, one last thing before we go. No, we did. We checked that. That's right. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. We can go back. So, yeah. Abyss Watchers. True, true. True, true, true. True dead. True that. Mm. Right, let's go in. The catacombs. Not sure if we'll finish this area today. Possibly, it's not too bad. If we keep a decent pace. These guys. It's just. Two hits. Two hits and dead. Yes, I haven't forgotten about him. I just thought I had some time to kill. These are the pain in the ass. Are you ready for this? Hyper mobile. Very aggressive. No. Nothing fancy. Ooh. And oh yeah, I forgot they go invisible. They do, however, still fall off ledges. Oh fuck's sake! Owie! Owie! No! No! Yeah, there we go. All of you walk off ledges. Spare me the effort of actually having to kill you. Um, so this area, I don't know, it's kind of fun. I do, I do really like the design of it. Single shaft of light streaming down the middle. And yet it remains remarkably well lit. Even given the amount of candles everywhere. On the subject of which, who seriously, like, is keeping these going? Because candles don't just burn infinitely. Which means somebody's job must be to go around and replace them. That's pretty much the definition of drawing the short straw, I think. Unless it's another skelly, bro. Ugh. Why? 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 Dumbass attacks. Three. Scimitar, sure, great, fantastic. Hey Paul, skeletons like candles? I guess so. Skeletons gods? Really hipster. Ow! Oh. Are you seriously stabbing me with an arrow? thing about Paul is he'll claim to know a great many things. Don't automatically believe him. Ba -na 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 -na. Down we go. A candle's emo? I would have thought they were more goth. I don't know. Not hugely well versed in either... What I wanted to say brand. Brand's not the term. Um... Fashion group? I don't know. However you want to label it. 
Come on then. Come on. Give me your grief. Oh, I suppose I did ask. I did ask. Blood loss. Great. I lost some blood. Who would have thought it? With all these weapons going around. Huge pain in the ass. Jesus Christ. Don't forget the cheeses. No. No. Yeah, that's about right. That's about right. This is, of course, illusory wall. Um, let's have that. Ah, oh, yes, we really need that. Perfect. That should be everything we need to make these swords stronger. Even more power. Infinite power. There we go. I am chugging through this Estus today. Estus! No. No. What? I'd do a backflip? I did not know this. No. Dick. I took way more damage than I had to by doing that, but... That's no jumping spot, you absolute liar. Uh, I think he saw me, but he's not going to reach me from there. Cool. I was fully expecting the floor to give way. Carthus Pyromancy Tome. Perfect. Something worth this little side trip. Uh, Pyromancy Tome from Carthus, containing pyromancies crafted for battle. Carthus Pyromancy is developed in isolation from other forms. Explaining their divergent evolution. So Carthus is a bit different. Is Carthus a land? A city? What? A country? Oh yes, we have more physics objects glitching out. Perfect. I assume that's a bit of a vertebra. Anyway, Dark Souls has found the energy solution. Perpetual motion. They've nailed it. There's segments of spine. Shit. Oh, we're in trouble. We're in trouble. Let's get the item. And then I think we run away. Run away! Run away! Run away! Run away! Run away! Run harder! Run harder! Oh, we're basically dead. We're so dead. Hmm. That's what I was waiting for. But it was slower than I expected. Whoopsie daisy. Shit happens. Gargoyle flame hammer. Let's try this again. Uh, yeah. Now, since that's where we come down, oh, we need to find that. Hmm. Shortcuts. And 
down again. No, it's not. You liar. You liar. Do you take me for a fool? Let's not get hit by that. Okay. Let's follow it. Should at the very least be able to get our souls back. Don't get hit. Don't get hit. Somebody died from the giant death ball. It's one of the guys who was having his way with me before. That makes me feel a little bit better. This way. This way. Ah. Oh. One on their own can't be too bad, right? More aggressive. Much more aggressive. This is the key. This is the key. Can't... Not quite enough detail on these... Wall panels. I do love the way your character actually does generate light. Notice it in the dark areas more. Hmm... Yep, look at that trap. That's tactical withdrawal, not a retreat. Totally different things. Thank you. Thanking you. Um. Um. Oh ho. Hey, birdie. I love this guy. He died having a good time. Do we agree? We agree, right? I'm just going to assume. Because he looks like a happy skeleton. Oh, that's an even better angle. Yeah. He died on his happiest day. Oh, if you're gonna go. Uh, how very fortunate. Have you seen my companion, Horace? To my shame, I was snared by a trap and we've become separated. I've not been able to find him since. I can't say I have. Old Mr. Mm. All he says. Yes, I see. Horace is a valiant knight. He can look after himself, no question. Sure can. He's probably searching for me right now, with twice the resolve. Mm. If you happen upon him, please tell him that I remained in the catacomb, and I will lay prison stones to guide him, as always. Please send him word, I beg of you. May the flames guide your way. Prism stones, you say? He is indeed legless. Maybe that explains the jolly smile on his face. He's all good and liquored up. There should be a sparkle. I heard the sparkle. Sparkle, sparkle. Back we go. Promise I'll tell you if we find him. I promise. Go. Don't get greedy. Don't get greedy. Oh, we made it anyway. We're fine. Okay. Now that we killed that guy, who may or may not have been a necromancer, you missed his pointy little tricorner hat, but. There we go. He was controlling the ball of uh, arms, legs, and whatever else was in there to form the skelly ball. A dead bone shard. Perfect. I spent so much of my first playthrough thinking this had to open. For a shortcut. But, nope. There's the lever. Defeated by a simple broken lever. Two attacks will do. What? What? 
did not know they could do that. That's insane. Parried by a one-armed, headless enemy. A skeleton at that. Okay. This guy still needs to die a couple of times. It's like he gets magic without having to cast, which is cheap. In my books. Magic pots. Throwing at me. Mucho is unfair. Yeah. I don't know. Have you seen a horse eat its own face? If not, then you may not have seen everything. I feel like I've pulled that from something, but I can't think what for the life of me. Seems like the kind of thing that maybe might boosh. Oh no. Pots are traps. Everything's a trap. Everything's a trap. Run away. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Everything in the world wants to kill us. Okay, we're good. We're good. You see this pot in the middle here that's on a little lever. I promise you it is on a depressed switch. Carthus Milk Ring. Er, let's read that. Carthus Milk Ring. There we go. Ring, bo uh, ring, born. ring worn by warriors of the Sand Kingdom, Carthus. So, essentially the Middle East. Although, I suppose. For all I know, the Middle East could be surprisingly green and vegetative. The sword technique of Carthus allows for fluid movement with a curved sword. Masters of the technique are said to dazzle their opponents by moving as weightlessly as a grain of sand. They live for their High Lord Volnir, or Walnir, conqueror of most kingdoms known to their people. So, a bit of a Genghis Khan type. Uh, yeah, we'll leave that on there. So, I shouldn't have done that. What happens there is you press that switch and it fires arrows from the walls that not only potentially hit you as you're trying to run away, but also smash all the pots that release all the black magic things, whatever you want to call them. I think they're meant to be pursuers, but they'll be these. So they all attack you at the same time. It's kind of cruel. These guys are all legless. They're all looking kind of happy, to be honest. No. I don't know. Seems like joy to me. Hmm. Uh huh. Was one hell of a party, you're right. Uh. Although, no cake. Which always, no matter how good the party, if there's no cake, bit of a letdown if I'm honest. Let's use this. Will it work? Will it work? Yeah. Pro skills, pro strats, MLG Dark Souls. Oh! Uh, thought I'd managed to glitch up somewhere. Okay. Two at once, just for funzos. Let's use more switches. Totally worth it. Let's do it again a third time. Okay, that's one down. That's man up. Big man up. Stab you in the butt. Butt stabs. The style of... Petonia. Ah. I 
I wish I would ever actually remember I have that backflip cartwheel thing. I never do it on purpose. I wonder if it still breaks guards. Shit! Oh, we... Stop messing around. Titanite. Can't jump that. Wants us to try, but we can't. Hey, a birdie. Look who I see. More giant rats. Who's kind of... Wobbling. Not sure if that's meant to be a more fluid animation, but it's not. They fall in no one. Uh, that's right. Mind the hole. Ember. Near. Near. It's fine. Yes. Shit. It's actually got rib cages and stuff in there too, I just realised. Uh, let's get the item. Barge Titanite. Teat and eat. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Are we okay? We're okay. So odd. So odd. Take a seat. Let's. Mm, yeah. Let's try and keep this simple. Don't need that. Run! Hoof it, lads! Let's trick these guys into getting bouldered. No, I'm going to drag them out of the way, aren't I? Exactly the opposite of what I wanted. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Mobbed, mobbed. Don't want to back up too much because I don't know how much space I have before something else gets me. More than I thought. Okay. Let's... Thinking about it, wouldn't skeletons burn like paper with those candles everywhere? I don't know. Does bone burn? I wouldn't have thought so. Calcium? I don't know. Have you been trying to burn away corpses, Paul? Do you have some experience on this? How many bodies are hidden under your patio exactly? Uh, there we go. It's all dried up. Maybe. Rats look like Nutcracker Rat King in his army. Really? You saw a darker version of the Nutcracker than I did. Considerably darker. Um, let's do one floor at a time. Oh yeah, wheel skeletons. I forgot. Okay, so this is happening. Yeah, look at that meant to fall on. Oh no! I was going to say, look at that slime about to, uh, or supposed to fall on my head as I go for the item. What actually happened, of course, is it just got me. Hmm, embarrassing. All for some titanite. Titanite. Another slime or two just missed. Best enemy. Style wise, anyway. Bones would not burn. Colour me shocked. Mm. 
most minerals not well known for their combustible properties. Dick off! Is that all of them? One left. Have it! Yeah. Yeah. This mask is starting to annoy me. Totally hear something ready to attack me. Doesn't look good, not gonna lie. Back to that. Hang on. I, I knew it. I was like, what's going to fall on my head as I go down this way? Turns out the answer is a lot of shit. I was trying too much to run away. Didn't even see what the item was. Great. That crunching sound. Something very real about it. I bet it's some guy with some crunchy lettuce real close to a microphone. Just feels like it. I don't I don't actually know what I picked up. I honestly don't. I don't think it's a weapon. May have been that. Celery. Yeah, maybe. Does sound like they've got some real grinding molars in them, though. Proper crunching up people. Or animals, I guess. Yeah, you can live, Slimo. Alright, let's go check the other ways. Hmm. For no real reason, let's Ember. Ember immediately replaced what we lost. Night Slayer Sorig, who has the biggest of big giant swords. Ow! And I still managed to underestimate it. Fuck that up. Heels! Back away like a real coward. Yeah, more Berserk references, don't worry. They're everywhere. They never stop. I'm never going to win in that kind of trade. I do win in that, though. This sword is so damn slow, it's kind of hard not to parry it. Ah, oh, fuck off. No! Damn it! Kinda lucky that didn't clip me. There we go. I think we're gonna switch this back. For now, at least. Nope. Not with two hands. 
Can I? Can I trick him? Not so easily. Oh, oh. He's getting the best of me, 100%. That slime's still trying. He's not giving up. That is some real determination. Oh, oh. Ah, ah. How'd that feel? Damn. Well, dicking around. Seemed to get me an emote. Interesting. My thanks. We're not going to go too much longer. I think I'm going to have one more go at him and then stop messing around and at least get the boss done before exploring further. Just follow the ball. It's probably a bad strategy. It was. It was very bad strategy. Um. Let's deal with the ratties before we fight. That was a lot more efficient. Anyone else waiting to surprise me? No? Okay. Um, 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 um yeah. Why not? Sure does feel dead. Although, how does dead feel? Probably not great. I wonder. Ha. Ah, didn't work, but... How close can I cut it? Nailed it. Not against that shield. Go on. Stand in the way. Mm. This feels cheap, but it's more funny than anything. At least for me it is. Oh. And if I kick him back out into it... Oh, not quite. I thought that was going to be really cool. Let's just finish it. Bye. Night Slayer's Ring. Ring of the Savage Sorig, more commonly known as the Night Slayer. Long ago, Sorig engaged the guardians of an ancient city in a bloody confrontation and returned with their rings as his prize, still frozen on their dismembered fingers. Pretty metal. Can't argue with that. Alright, let's deal with this dude. He was a huge pain in the ass. Okay, that was significantly easier than usual. What is up? Is up good? Well, here's the necromancer. Damn it. No. Back out. Back out. I submit. For now. Oh dear. <laughs> Perfect. Couldn't have planned it better. 
One more time, go on. Wishful thinking, I guess. Damn it. All over the place. That's them and my playing. I see you. That was weird. Titanite. And some weapon buff powder. This, I don't know. This is one of those things where the lore just feels kind of lacking again. There's there's dead people in the catacombs. Who would have who would have guessed? They're really pulling it out from left field. The world building, it's just by the books at this point. Spinning around. No. Come on. Are you serious? There. Oh yeah, he comes back to life. I remember. I remember. He wasn't annoying enough before, so let's have him re revive. Ugh. God damn it. There we go. We good. So Paul, have you have you started at was it Waitrose? It was Waitrose, wasn't it? Have you had a proper shift there yet? Uh, I see you. Right, I'm going to be quick so we can see the hilarious thing. So now that ball should explode. As we just heard. Visible wall. And out of it comes a crab. Why a crab? Fucked if I know. But apparently inside the middle. The crab doesn't have anything. It's just a crab. This was also in the bowl. Nothing special also though. Started this eat what so you've done your first shift now then? How'd you find it? Not too rough, I hope. Should be alright. Friday nights you'll get a lot of um a lot of booze going through the tills, I'd imagine, but... What time do you finish? Shut like 10 o'clock, I'd guess? Like I say, if you, can, if you can manage the tedium and just... Divert half your brain to thinking about something completely irrelevant to your task to entertain it, you'll usually be fine. Yeah, that's not too bad. So much health. Blood loss. Perfect. Sloppy play. Yeah. And yellow bug. I feel like I picked up some ashes. And in the mad rush. Umbral ash of the grave warden of the catacombs of Carthus. Not the best written part, but... The old man began as a squire, carrying his master's accoutrement. I think it possibly made that sound more French than it had to. He ended his days a grave warden and carried them still. Seems to be holding one of the kukri. Fairly steady. Yeah, yeah, you will get that. You won't just be stood around bored waiting for people 
give you something to do. Not at the supermarket, not in somewhere like um, wherever you live. <laughs> Cambridge, that's the one. I'm a bit tired. We're getting there. I, I, it's been a long day. I've been awake since like five. I'm not playing much longer, but we're nearly at the boss now. So I figure we get this done. Open up this shortcut before I die or something happens. That's weird. Not seen that happen before. Um. Hmm. Yeah, we only got like 10 15 minutes left, I think, today. We've already done 2 hours 15. How do we get up here? Am I losing my mind? I am. It's this way. Henri has made it further. Or Anri, I think as he pronounces it. Still looking quite perplexed. But oh, continuing on nonetheless. We meet again. Have you seen Horace anywhere? Still no. Oh, yes. I see. I've searched high and low with no luck. Perhaps he's left the catacombs. Oh, Horace. Where have you run off to? Oh, have you abandoned me? No. What a horrible thought. I know nothing. He may not be too wrong, though. As ironically... Oh look, there's Horace. I don't think this counts as us seeing him though. But he still seems to be watching, albeit from a distance. People underestimate how hard it is to just hold your arm out horizontally. He said vertically, I am getting tired. For a prolonged period of time still. It's, it's easy to dismiss it without trying it. Oh. Still say nothing, so it doesn't count as seeing him, even though that is indeed Horace down there. We'll we'll get a bit closer to him. Actually, might do it today. Let's finish it off. Got a very very creaky bridge, and I just want to do a thing because it amuses me. Oh no, an absolute shit ton of skeletons. What will I do? Oh no, oh no. Oh, oh, whoops, whoops. Oh no. Damn it. Thought they might fall on Horace. I didn't really, but I can hope. I can dream. That one day they fall on Horace. Rrr. Who's this? Gajil. That is a player. That is a human. Interesting architecture, eh? Just bases of bones. Urns of bones. Odd. Very odd. And in the centre of the room... Somebody forgot to keep this candle lit. It's the one unlit candle in the entire area. I think. I've not noticed another. Certainly very obvious anyway. How's the stream running today anyway, Kasia? Is it a little better? Is it smoother? A 
played around with some settings. Hopefully it's made it better. I don't know. Horace knows where to stand so we're not falling in. This horoscope. Ah, oh, That's awful, Paul. I'm proud. So, dark area. And an item. This isn't suspicious, right? We can do this. This will be fine. Huh. That's not suspicious. We can do this. We'll be fine. That definitely doesn't look like a hand. Oh, it's a face. Grave Warden Pyromancy Tome. Okie dokie. Cool boss, but um, fortunately, he's not actually anywhere near as tough as he looks. And sadly, he's also not anywhere near as interesting as he looks. He's not suspicious at all gold bands. Damn it. One broken. Look at that giant lump of health disappear. He's a looker, isn't he? Not an ounce of fat on him either. Miasma. Yeah, there's the toxic miasma. I don't think so. He may have legs. Problem is, if I go down to his lower body, I take a lot of damage very quickly and end up dead. There's another one. Another, like, nearly 5,000 health off him. Don't, don't go back, if anything. Get angry, okay, that's fine. Damn it. Hmm. He doesn't even seem to hit for a whole lot. I expected more. And that's Walnir. Maybe. I get the impression even if he wanted he couldn't really stand up and do a whole lot in here. But if his legs are there, it's probably safe to assume they're not in a great state. But then... He's not in peak physical condition generally, let's face it. <laughs> creaky doors. Always creaky doors. Well, not creaking necessarily per se in that instance, but... Gotta love a good door sound. Maybe even a psh. Star Trek style. Psh. Right. That's a lot of souls. Let's check out that soul that he has given us. High Lord Walnir. Lord Walnir, or Volnir of Carthus, censored censored the 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 Sentenced countless souls to gruesome deaths, keen to outlive them all. Okay. So we had a bit of a thing about, well, the very natural thing, fear of death. WD-40, yeah. God, that stuff's so useful. I'm going to almost immediately regret this, but... Let's go. 
Let's go say hi to Horace. Oh, Horace. <gasps> I forgot about this fun area. You can do a thing. I'm going to do a thing. No, not me. Chest. Totally not suspicious chest. Then if I hide... No? Are they not going to do it? Usually, it's possible to get them to fight each other. I didn't know he went back in. That's weird. Don't know who it thinks it's fallen. The arrow sticking out of it and the blood. Come on, then. Doesn't like it. Really? Big scary demon. You're a little bit big for here, really, aren't you? Let's try this. Will this work? Please work. Damn. 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 Riggedy riggedy wrecked. Oh no. We dead. We so dead. Save us Mimic Chan. No. Perfect. Yes. Battle of the century. Place your bets, guys. Mimic versus demon. Who will win? The Mimic just kick him off the edge. Oh. Mimic became more interested in us. Oh, flying kicks. Don't think I've ever seen that attack before. Oh, that's a big charge. That's a big charge up. That's mean. But yeah, he will also fight the skeletons. Let's get the item. Black blade. Run, 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 run away. Run away. We are going to have to fight this demon though, I think. Oh. I don't want to. That's about as well as I expected. My life bar. Yeah, I, I don't know where it went, but it definitely went. Yeah. Various shitty parts of play, basically. It's fine, we'll get down there, no problem. I do want to say hello to Horace before we end the stream. Oh. Black blade. Needs 18 strength. A short katana wielded by the swordsman and distinguished guest of High Lord Volnir. The shiny black blade is thick but shorter than the typical katana. The swordsman was a master of a rare technique, traces of which can be observed in his weapon's strong attack. It's kind of goofy. It's just a really yeah fairly sure it's just worse than what we have. Hey Amazes. 
Amazon struggle to read that on night mode. Yeah, it's on PC. Uh, let's go. Oh, shit. Well, there goes all those souls. All those lovely, lovely boss souls. That was dumb. That was real dumb. That's fine. Shit happens. Frequently. Particularly when you're tired and distracted. But this is fine. Made sure to pick up those zero souls this time, though. All important. And Ree seems to have moved on as well, worth noting. Don't know if that's because we reloaded the area, or... I don't know, because we defeated the boss, maybe? All the way down. There we go. I completely forgot about this little room here. Can't believe I did. I don't think it's worth killing this guy, is it? A lot of faff for no gain. So I might just leave him for a minute. Or at least let him distract the skeletons. Come on, I don't want them following me. Shit. There you go. Uh, yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. Hence, are they, they're they actually going to beat him. Wow. Go Skelly Bros. Soul of a Demon. It was worth it. Shit, that move. That was weird. Skimitar. Some of that. Some of that. That's how we like it. Um, try again. So fast. Not really worth it. In that, no. Screw this. That's better. I want to get it though. So slow. There we go. That's better. Uh, right. This completely wasn't the point of this area. Still kind of salty about these 40k souls too. But it's fine. Which is ring. What is that doing this again? Uh, greatly boost pyromancies. The witch of Isolith and her daughters, scorched by the flame of chaos, taught humans the art of pyromancy and offered them this ring. Every pyromancer is familiar with the parable that tells of the witches espousing the need to fear the flame and teaching the art of pyromancy to men in hopes that they might learn to control it. If I remember correctly, this is the ring in Dark Souls 1 that led us taught to uh, Kailana, the spider firekeeper lady. Okay. We're going to have one go at Horace, and then we're going to call it a night. Because no, my luck, I'm still going to wake up some silly, relatively early time. Regardless of what time I actually go to bed. My body's going to be like, no, no, you're going to be late for work. You remember work? You're going to be late for it. This area sucks. See that giant ballista? And I mean giant. Mm. Oh, 
Oh my god, I just remembered I still have pizza. Good times. Got to finish that off after the stream. There we go. Twinkle, twinkle. Ah, oh, another one. It's a little treasure trove. What? What? Are you for real? Uh, I guess he died somehow? That was weird. That was real weird. Hey, Horace. How you doing? I'm not expecting or wanting a fight here. Honest. You do seem to have your weapon out. Hmm. Horace the Hushed. That was poor. Whew. Held that way longer than I expected. Horrifying murder bang. Well done, Paul. Well done. Well done on the puns. I think you can possibly do even better than that, though. We can get cheesier. Holy shit, that spear. Or halberd, even. He's, he's, yeah, he's on to me. He's definitely on to me. There we go. Ah, ah. Bad Horace. Bad Horace, I said. Do we dare? Ah, oh, we got it. We got it. We got the fancy parry with the sword. So hard to pull off. And it's not worth it. Oh, we did it twice in a row. I feel like a badass right now. That makes up for falling off an edge and losing 40,000 souls. Llewellyn Shield. Lawrence Llewellyn Shield. Yellow pellet. Hmm. So no real explanation as to why he's down here and why he seems to have abandoned Anri. I believe the best theory I read, and I'm not sure what it's based off, but um, is that he's kind of jealous that we're becoming close with Anri. And he wanted to be the one, not romantically, but like close and guiding him through. Anyway. Well, this was the point where I was gonna go and spend those boss souls. And do a bit of cleanup, but I guess kind of don't need to now. I think we have more of this kind of thing, though. There we go. Oh, well. We'll never hear Horace grunt again. Ah, well met. Have gracious passing fine ash thou hast given. Let this ash be stone nourishment. I only hope the... <laughs> she now gives us a div hidden blessing, even. Holy water blessed by the Queen of Lothric. There is a grave in Lothric that sees no visitors, a dark place where rootless warriors rest. The Queen of Lothric alone cared to wish the poor souls good fortune. Your guess is good as mine there. 20,000 for the... F fucking key that we could have got at this point. Oh, infuriating. And we have the undead legion armor. These undead warriors vowed to partake of wolf blood. They acted in the dark, seeking out any signs of the abyss. 
fighting a constant war with its abominations. So it's kind of fitting that we see the um, Dark Wraiths there, who are basically ambassadors for the Abyss. They love it. They distinctly love it. All right. Nothing overly interesting there, Mark. Ah, well met. Tis good to see ye in good health. What needs Smithy? Estus, don't have any. Reinforce. We can do it. We can do one weapon. Let's check something. That is 216. If I make this sharp... One nine five, if I'm doing the maths right there, that's right, isn't it? I'm gonna do it anyway. Uh, no, I'm not. We're gonna hold off on the twin blades for a while. We are going to upgrade the Uchi Katana though. Pretty be careful. Pretty. <laughs> I also think we have something to give to this fella. Back again, I see. I suppose this means you're after sorceries. I mean, not really. I'm actually more here to help you. Oh my. This is stupendous. And the undead legion of Farron possesses sorceries quite unknown. Thank you. For upholding your end of the bargain. I doubt I ever would have made this discovery alone. No. Now, probably not. Let us unravel the thing. So you may put these new sorceries to use. About that. <laughs> I don't really give a fuck about your sorceries. But yeah. Come again. Anyway. I think that's pretty much going to wrap it up for now. Uh, oh. Let's see if we can make any interesting weapons first. I think we might, but I don't think it's going to be fitting for what we're doing, so I'm going to hold off. We can make Waldir's Holy Sword, which he didn't actually even have chance to pull out during the fight. Eroded by the Abyss. When Waldir fell to the Abyss, he was gripped by a fear of true darkness and pleaded to the gods for the first time. His Holy Sword, together with three armlets, stripped from the corpses of clerics, gave him some semblance of comfort three armlets stripped from the corpses of clerics they seemed a bit big to be stripped from human sized corpses but hey ho I kind of want to dick around with fist weapons too but they're awful wolf knight's greatsword greatsword of a knight tainted by the dark of the abyss and master of the wolf's blood of Farron. The Wolf Knight was the first Abyss Watcher, and his sword is more punishing against creations of the Abyss. Such cool sword. I do really like it. I may actually end up picking this up. In fact, I think I'm going to do that right now. Because it is a dex-based greatsword. Great sword of the Abyss Watchers, which is atypically paired with an unusual dagger, which can be used for parrying. It's quite cool. Dagger is utilised as a wedge in the left hand, while the greatsword is held in the right. A unique technique that was synonymous with the Undead Legion. Confounds foes in the manner of wolves hunting prey. You know what, sod it, if nothing else, so I can show a thing. So we do, should we do some cool nonsense before we leave and finish for the day? I think we should. I'm not really asking. We're doing cool nonsense. I need more strength, really, but we'll be fine for now. Big old sword. Big old dagger. Whoops. That's the dagger anyway. Super exciting as it is. Yeah. Straightforward. Big sword. Big sword hits things. Oh, I do love doing that. It's so dumb, but it's so satisfying. So 
Tom. Anyway. Enough playtime. Like I say, I think we're going to end it here for today. Um, carry on downwards, I guess, after this. Uh, I'm not really sure where to go next. I think it's a fairly straight line. But my memory of the exact sequence of levels in this game isn't perfect. Such is life. So... For now, at least. Thanks for popping by. It's good to see you guys. Hopefully see you next time. And for now, from me, goodbye. <laughs>